What, what sort of projects have you made that shows the themes that you're interested in? I did a movie called Restu from Sana. It's about a girl, a small girl. She's 10 years old. She's going through harassment in her family from one of her family, one person from her family, and then in that day that her sister is going to marry, she told her about that, tell her about all these things, and her sister need to decide if she will help her or take her and go to another place, or just she's gonna let her in that house and go and marry and leave her sister alone, and go and draw all the harassment in the family. This is one movie that I did, one film that I have did. And you produced it? It's I write the script, I, were, I write it, and also I directed it. This is that film, and another film that I did, it's also a fiction film, two fiction films, about a Palestinian child from Nablus that need to have a treatment of, uh, from the cancer. Her mom and his sister just searched for a treatment there and they didn't find a treatment there. So the mom found a treatment in Israel and she decided to take him to Israel, but his father was, um, was a violent person to his mom. So he was against uh, this treatment because he wanted the money of the treatment for himself. And that day when, when the mother decided that she taking her son to have this treatment, the sister sees the, that the father that have at least one year didn't come back to the home, he come back and that day the sister sees the father from the window. The mother decided that decided to tell her her daughter and uh, her daughter to take uh, her brother and take him to the treatment because there is a car outside that waiting for them. So she taking them outside and from there all the things goes on. Um, I'm not gonna do a spoiler for the story because uh, the film is not dead yet. I did another fiction movies, but didn't want to talk about that. About about some things in in our culture, in my culture, and then I did a uh, documentary films, sh- short documentary films. One of them was about basketball for girls where I live it wasn't so acceptable the basketball for girls wasn't wasn't so accepting there is a character there a girl 20 right now and she trying to have basketball for girls again after they stopped the basketball for girls for some years and she worked that for that uh, to for the girls so they can play basketball again and she did that in the story they have now a course for basketball course a big course for basketball for girls only for girls this is one documentary film and another documentary film that i did was about a friend that i knew in the other school that after that we finished the school, she goes to another country to learn and to study. And a sick person had had kidnapped her and that night and killed her. I did a documentary film about that, short film. And I did a documentary film with her teachers. The girl was from Baka, where I live. I did some interviews with uh, some teachers, and we had uh, some uh, some videos about her before it all gone gone, before it all happened. 
I'm making a new documentary film about seven, the only seven Arabic women that uh, they are a bus driver. I just started making it. Still didn't start the interviews and all this thing. Didn't start to photograph. Uh, they are from here. This is the only seven Arabic women that that they are a bus driver from this area. From all of the north, from all of this place. Uh -huh. it's so it's so hard. They have so many difficulties that they're going through. How the people here accept this or not? How they think about this? <laughs>